Merry Christmas, everybody. I'm staying at home because of the Corona uh, defense team in Korea put me in the home to stay more than 10 days without any uh, possibility of uh, virus contamination. Anyway, I appreciate all the environment to reviewing what I did in Europe and also I'm trying to explain what simple version of iStudio can do now in real-time operation to demonstrate how iStudio really make a live presentation for everybody to make their all the information, all the presentation can be put in the cloud. So in the classroom when teachers and students meet, they can share more like interactive talking and discussion and coachings while the valuable presentation video or lecturing we can put in cloud. That's what I really make in this year, so I will show what the real Tarim Christmas presentation for presenters, for the educators, uh, I want to explain today using this video. So first I would like to make uh, this uh, uh, the sound slightly reduce the volume. This is uh, basically the YouTube video, so I just remove. So on this virtual screen, this is the screen, the virtual screen, where we can put PowerPoint, where we can put pictures, drawings, uh, whatever you want. It's like you did in electric whiteboard or a project screen in the classroom. So now I show uh, the, for example, uh, this kind of picture, which means uh, I'm showing the camera, live camera. Now I use a chroma key camera like this. This is camera. This is a video from monitor. And also we have another zoom screen here, so you will see the zoom screen here, uh, where you can uh, you can put the zoom uh, if you if you have a connection here. So this is a uh, the zoom main uh, window in the second monitor. So any students coming here, they will see on this project screen. And also we have a PowerPoint preview here. This is a. Uh, the flexible environment and also maybe I can show you another uh, another feature that uh, on on this menu uh, I can I can bring the uh, for example the menu I'm using so the the screen in in iStudio screen for example this one is showing where I'm, I'm doing now for example if I bring this way the the the, the iStudio 300 menu here you see the PowerPoint, here you see the, uh, this is uh, the note of this slide and PowerPoint screen and this is content which you can uh, modify on this virtual uh, virtual screen, virtual electric whiteboard. So if I click this one, it, it shows the, uh, this screen. If I click uh, this one, it comes back to here. So all this one you can bring on this container, files, live videos, Windows application, whatever you can bring. And then whatever you click, it will show on this virtual screen. Same thing here, but on this uh, ICS 300, uh, we don't have switcher on other layer. But 400, we have uh, all the uh, switches in multiple screens. That way we make uh, 300, 400, 200, and also the 5,000 and 7,000 to uh, increase the number of uh, the functions and also complexity there. Anyway, this is a basic function. So first step they normally do is changing studio uh, like this. So you see here we have uh, three scenes. So one scene coming like this. So this is kind of studio view. So what I'm, what I'm trying to show here is how we change the background. You see the, the, this part, for example, uh, on this part I can, I can change the background like this. This is the, the uh, a photo from a German shopping mall. And also this is photo from small doors. I, I just take a photo showing there. Uh, if you look at carefully, there is something is flowing here. This is a background image mixing to save the CPU power instead of use uh, GPU mixing. So the no, no more CPU uh, lose. CPU has a lot of function to do like uh, encoding, uh, managing the content, these kind of things. So uh, let's go back to see what's happening here. So to, to have this screen, I'll bring uh, this way like this. So here we have a Skype, so of course we can, we can use Skype as well. 
So here we, if you if you select this layer and if you press whatever here, it will change the background. So that is the one idea. Here desk you can change desk, the inputs, uh, everything is managing from here. This is a virtual scene change, virtual camera. So because we bring teacher and teaching material in virtual classroom where we can manage the virtual camera. Whenever the virtual camera has a position to show the presenter's face big or small, and there you can manage the each screen independently. This is uh, uh, another technology we, we develop and, and uh, uh, protected technology there too. So anyway, the this is a one scene. So let's let's make uh, the studio uh, using uh, maybe let's try uh, this way the studio in front. This way studio in front of Spain uh, the. Uh, what is this? Uh, this is uh, the uh, Trevi uh, pond. This is uh, another scene in, in in there, and this is uh, uh, what called uh, the Colosseum. So I can change the uh, different background in the back, so it will change the complete different style like this way. So whatever in the background you can put to have a different atmosphere, to have a different view. So. Let, let me let me take this one uh, for this scene. Of course, this one also can change color, so you, you can make a different feeling after you change the color. So all the animation you can put, we call this is skybox layer. Okay, so that way you can make a different uh, atmosphere for the studio and presentation. So there, are, once you have this studio, you can make a scene. So first scene and second scene, third scene. Now we have three scene. One is a studio view, second is actor view, third scene is a presenter view. This is simple three stage for presentation. All the presentation when when this virtual monitor where you can put the PowerPoint or any uh, zoom image uh, on on here. Let's make a PPT. So uh, that way you can put multiple. Uh, like whiteboard, so you can manage it different to show on the students. So let me go back to this PowerPoint. So there is a, a three main product line in this year. We are we are starting to announce together with iStudio. Previous time we just make iStudio server. So system integrity coming to connect camera, connect the microphone, and do all the wiring. And they put the console desk. They would put the control room and then preview for the actor, this kind of studio they built. But from this year, what I found is the best idea is to make all operation by the presenter. That's why we make all in one studio. Instead of selling only the server itself, we provide a complete broadcast station for any person to do by himself. So here is a lecture desk, which can put in the, any seminar room, control conference room, so any presenter, it's like they bring notebook, they connect, they start the presentation. We doesn't do any uh, teaching for the presenter, we only ask them present it as, 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 as this. Just a normal presentation they do, all the rest part of broadcasting, iStudio will take care of. So this, this system is called the uh, uh, iLecture desk. This is a, a normal desk where we put uh, uh, six monitors there or five monitors there. So two zoom normally here and then I see output here and also all the settings, switching, content you can put in there. Uh, sometimes you do zoom, same time you make a uh, uh, YouTube, these kind of things. Uh, this is a little bit bigger, about the 65 inch monitor or 75 inch monitor you can put, it's very heavy. And also we need a height adjustment. All this table, the basic function is they make a height control. And also all this table has a very strong wheel, so they can easily move in any place. So that's the basic idea how we put the multiple screen with iStudio server in every, every machine has a server inside. So all the cables, uh, the connections, very, very easy. So all the mounting of camera and the microphone, everything inside. That's the all-in-one broadcast station for user to make this. So uh, this one, uh, for example, uh, let's say uh, the, uh, the lecture desk, if you put this one in the classroom, the teacher, of course we can put the background, or well, doesn't matter whether the background is not or not, but once you have a green background, it will make a much better, much better chroma key. Anyway, uh, if you do normal presentation, it's like they do in the classroom, PowerPoint, next slide, whatever. When they do, 
All eye studio automatically make a virtual uh, scene change. At the same time, this video going to the remote class or the smartphone, so the all the participants can show here. So the students can uh, can stay in the in the classroom watching the other remote students in the classroom like this. Uh, when you have a bigger, uh, the large classroom or uh, auditorium, you need a big, uh, a larger projector where you put uh, multiple students there or uh, remote people's presentation screen here, and also you have output there. So in this case, it's better we put a little bit bigger, like this kind of uh, the eye desk. But basically, the teacher has to watch the students without disturbing, protecting by the monitor. So we make an angle lower and the, the teacher can see students without any, dis, any uh, uh, disturbance by the monitor uh, in front. So the uh, two styles, one is uh, this one just uh, make the same height to have a vertical angle to make a self-studio. The other one is for the classroom. So we have uh, two products to put in, in the classroom, small, small one this, big one like this. And when you have this kind of uh, uh, eye stand, you can put in any existing studio, they it, it convert into self-studio. So if you look at all the existing studio, the problem is the studio, they need the operator, they need the production director. So eventually, they need a project to make one video recording. But once we make a self-studio like this, every time any person coming with a USB PowerPoint, they can do operation by themselves. The other one big market we are trying is to put this one in the conference room. Every presentation conference has been made using telepresence system, which bring two monitor, one is for presenter, the other one is a presenting material. The way I'm doing, we are doing here, is not that kind of things. What we are doing here is uh, uh, making telepresentation is like I'm doing. The presenter here, the difference is presenter's face always bring big. When the presenter going presenting material like this, immediately this screen become big. So all the uh, students in remotely or in the classroom, when they see this output directly in the projector screen, they can automatically concentrate on what they have to see. The teacher don't have to worry where the students are watching because teacher is managing all the content by himself. Furthermore, in this case, they uh, they do more uh, freely talking and also. They have uh, uh, the Zoom screen here, so the, the remote students also can be shown. The students can feel they are sitting in the same, t uh, same classroom together. Once you have a multiple class, remote class, the classroom video can show there. In that case, Zoom, we need a multiple, uh, multiple the account. So the other people normally using multiple notebooks. Instead, we provide the uh, uh, Tari My Studio Meet program, which is a multi-channel uh, solution, so you can open multiple classrooms independently, showing in the project screen or the TV screen. That's what we are trying. So eventually, uh, using these three uh, systems, iStudio Lecture Desk, iStudio Desk, iStudio Stand, can cover any case of broadcast environment. It will turn into a uh, presentation studio in any place in the world. So I studio stations in everywhere to bring any time, any person's uh, presentation video as like a CNN news video recording. So it will come to cloud. So we have uh, three group of product line. One is uh, uh, we call the next generation broadcast uh, tools. Uh, second one is a professional broadcast studio. And the other one is the uh, one touch studio. So now we, I'm using uh, 300 to make a professional way. As you see, this kind of video you never saw from any place in the world. This is a first self-studio, so people can do this one very easily from any, anywhere. So I would like to uh, show this technology for every classroom, every, uh, every uh, self-studio, every large auditorium room, every existing studio and also every meeting room is to convert the, uh, the closed room to be uh, open to every people. So three group of products, uh, the hardware is same, but software we have a different one is uh, 200, uh, 200 series, which is very, very simple. So uh, really no necessary anything, just about presentation, then everything done by the iStudio. 300, today I explain how flexibly you can manage all the content, how you change the scene to make a professional studio from single cameras. 400, we have more flexibility. Maybe tomorrow I can show some demo using 400. 
and 5,000, 7,000, all the beauties of multiple actors, multiple presenters, talk shows, whatever you imagine they can do from my student, 7,000. 7,000 is more, uh, more professional, more uh, uh, technical things you need because we use a full 3D object there. So in, in here, of course it's a 3D engine, but some layer we use a 2D to make a, a 3D effect. But anyway, here, 7,000, 5,000, we can make more scenes. Now the ISO 300, as you see, we have a first scene. So the first scene automatically doing uh, a scene change like this. But uh, 400 more scene, 5,000 have 12 scene, 7,000 24 scene with a more virtual electric whiteboard there. So everything is intelligently designed. The concept is same. When you start presentation, everything is done by automatically. So today I, I show you uh, many different cases of the iStudio. So how we make iStudio change, uh, you will uh, understand. The, the, the old iStudio has uh, tools to create virtual classroom. Second, old iStudio has a real electric whiteboard managing by the presenter. Third, we have a virtual camera, so you make a one camera here, the other camera there, or something like that. And finally, we have a automatic smart PD future, so all the camera switching you don't have to worry about the camera switching done by intelligent function of iStudio so this whole part is the main patent pending and also patented technology we are claiming to change the world of presentation which is called telepresentation world so the this whole whole of, for technology we we have uh, studio design virtual camera and camera uh, content switching with a, a special effect and also smart PD function will make your presentation from anywhere. So all this one, we are trying to put this one in, in everywhere. So far we use a server, rank mount, transportation system, like uh, this computer and monitor and all the accessory they, they provide for iStudio. Now we are making iDesk, iStand, and also iConsole, which means the everything is integrated so the only thing you have to do is connect the network cable and power, that's it. Then everything is done. And also a huge amount of uh, design tool like a uh, desk, uh, floor, wall, everything come together. So you can slightly modify use or you can create by yourself with uh, very simple tools we are providing. So today I, I show you how nicely you can put this one. So every existing studio, when they have a control room, you can put I stand here. Then you can put more people sitting to join this uh, talk show or presentation so together. So this is a self studio. So the any person in two meter by two meter, you can create very professional broadcast studio in any place. And also you can put this one in the meeting room. You can put in an uh, existing uh, video conference room. You can put this one in large class or auditorium room. And normal class, just uh, simply you can put I lectern so they will convert the classroom to be the broadcast studio. So all this future, you, if you look at, there are many different different segments we have to approach. One is uh, existing studio. You can, uh, you can imagine how many studios already exist in every city, every country. All the studio based on uh, the operator. They, when they do any recording or broadcasting, they need to come to there, discuss with the operator or broadcast production director how they uh, shoot, how they record, how they edit. All this bureaucratic way is uh, completely changed because uh, we are providing all-in-one automatic uh, broadcast studio. So of course they can they can use existing technology, but basically. Uh, if they know the uh, way how they make a uh, shooting, how they make a uh, lighting, how they uh, optimize the camera action, it will help. But basically, iStudio taking care of everything by ourselves. Second one is uh, many people now looking for new generation of classroom to share content from one class to another class or the broadcasting to any students in outside of the world. So those kind of new classroom solution we have, we call this is a next generation classroom. We are providing not only the iStudio, but also the screen management software to make a digital facade uh, the environment, to make a whole world as a virtual screen. So uh, students will feel this is kind of a new classroom. The interior design, not any more painting. All the walls become the new uh, class where we can put change all the different content. 
Now, the only this uh, decoration bottles we use that wall as like a multiple uh, the uh, distance classroom students showing there. So it looks like they're sitting in a virtual world where all other classrooms together. The third part is uh, the uh, existing classroom. Whenever they have a classroom with a projector or electric whiteboard, you just put iStudio there so that it will convert the studio, automatically record with a beautiful screen as like I'm doing now. So the other thing is uh, the large class auditorium. A huge problem of presentation happening there because of the large class, the teacher's face is too small. They need the broadcast technology to show the teacher in the another screen, PowerPoint in the other screen. They put multiple projectors there. All this one is a very simplified and also very uh, enhanced way of presentation using iStudio, like you see. When you, when you keep talking, the screen automatically bring teacher to make a big screen. So students see the face of the teacher in the big screen to, to see their gesture, their minds, their face, their eye going there. So once the teacher is watching this camera direction, the eye going to every individual student providing virtual electric simultaneous eye contact there. So this is uh, what I'm trying to change the way of presentation in every place. And then how many video conference, how many telepresentation system has been made. Whatever they do video conference for presentation, they have to use the telepresence system, which is uh, the presentation people showing in one TV, presenting material in another projector screen. So they, they simulate the environment where the teacher and presenter and presenting material showing. But what it happened is they don't know when the audience has to watch teacher when they should watch to a project screen. Eventually everybody watching only project screen. This is what happened during the past 20 years from Cisco, from Polycom, all the video telepresent system which who is using dual codec to send the peer-to-peer -peer places using that kind of conference system. The pattern technology we are providing is the combining the screen, just showing one screen. When teacher has to see, the teacher has to be. When presenting material has to see, we have to show the presenting material automatically there, depending on what gestures, so how the pointer is going there, something like this way. So this is the completely new way of presentation. Nobody imagines such kind of function can be possible. We really make all the uh, detail part to make it happen. So the tele-presentation world really happening. Tele-presence and tele-presentation is different. I study is the world first tele-presentation system which can put in everywhere. The desktop broadcast station is really possible. After we have a personal computer, now it's time to have a personal broadcast station. This is what I'm trying to claiming there. So the only part I'm showing, uh, explaining here is uh, all this title here, showing is the uh, note of the presentation uh, things. What I show here is this. So you will see the mixer screen. So I can bring this mixer screen here, making this one big. And uh, so you will see how, how it looks like. This is PowerPoint slide. This is the note. All this note showing here is uh, titling automatically. When you have a uh, uh, another uh, the uh, slide, it will change another title, which is the title, uh, doc the the uh, the note. Every slide automatically makes titling. Of course, you can make uh, this one prompter to show another screen where the big uh, titling you can see is like a prompter. Many detail part, a uh, lot of functions we we add for you to understand. Basically, this is a. Uh, uh, a title show, there's a painter, so you can, you can draw any painting, different colors, everything is possible there. That's what I really make, this system for broadcasting from any place to any, uh, any country or any uh, time in, in, on this planet. Hope you enjoy my presentation. That's why I say this is uh, the uh, small uh, Xmas Christmas presentation uh, present for all the people in the world. I hope you enjoy my presentation. Even my English is not, uh, not uh, good, but you, you will see a lot of video, a lot of functions, so you will understand what I'm trying to explain. Hope you enjoy Christmas. Even we have a very difficult time with uh, COVID, I do believe we will uh, make a next generation of presentation, so which will turn into different level of presentation.
no more the teacher has to come to the class no more students has to come to the class to listen to the lesson now what I'm claiming is listening lesson from smart device which is called smart class if you watch my video from your smart device I, I am defining this is the definition of smart class the smart class watching is the best way to understand to see the teacher to see the projecting material if you make content from my studio Thank you very much. Hope you uh, have a great uh, time with Christmas. Maybe I will make another version using 400, 5000 and 7000. Thank you very much. Bye.